Hi, I'm Heather Hansen. This is the Super Groovy Cosmic Bus. I'm at Simon Space with Autonomics. I heard they're okay. Let's find out. Tell me your name, what musical instrument you play, and what's your sign? Uh. And does your mom like you? <laughs> Hi, my name is Dan. Uh, I play guitar and sing. Uh, I'm an aquarium, and my mom thinks I'm really special. Uh, my name's Evan, and I play drums. I'm a Gemini, and my mom thinks that I'm also really special. Uh, I'm Vaughn. I'm a Gemini as well, and Dan's mom thinks I'm really great. <laughs> I got two questions though. Okay, Ursula, which is your band band. When you first got it, it kind of smelled like cat pee, but it doesn't anymore. How'd that? How'd you get rid of that smell? She, I'm sorry. She, <laughs> Ursula, I'm sorry, darling. I don't know. How did we get the smell out? Uh, did awesome. you notice that the smell is gone? I, I did. Remember. It was definitely yeah, because I. I I wrote back from Boise. Now it just smells like Nebraska. It smells... <laughs> what does Nebraska smell like? like Depression? And, yeah, like... Um, okay. I don't know. I think we just didn't shower, like, enough. Okay, that's a really nice segue to my next question. How do you guys stand each other's stank? Or do you just get used to it? And, like... Because I... I a, it's been a really long time. <laughs> right? right? Yeah, we It's all just blended together. Right? right? Yeah. Right. There's, it's like this, there's, like, this uniform stink. stink. It's like, you know how you, you don't mind? Right. Now we become one your unit. Yeah. yeah. Right. I can see that. I can but see it's, that. It's three times as offensive to everyone else. Right. So okay. okay. Yeah, we've definitely upset some people. <laughs> Did like, you really? We've, yeah, we've definitely like yeah. okay, so we'll like we'll play a show at some random place and then um, you know, explain to everybody that we need a place to stay. <laughs> and then nobody will really like say anything until everyone's drunk. <laughs> and then, and then there's like the uh, like that one drunk guy who, or that drunk girl who's just like, you can stay at our house, like, and then, <laughs> and then we're like, and we're like, okay, cool. We don't even talk about it or like, sit, mm. we're not even like, are you sure? Like, yeah. we're like, okay, cool. Right. And then we get over there and we just you know keep hanging out. And then the next morning they wake up and they're just like, oh shit, I got <laughs> like, uh, I brought that band home <laughs> last night. Oh, that smells so bad. Or there's like. like there's always somebody who's really down for us to stay there. Yeah. But we gotta get the fuck out of there, like <laughs> right. right when the sun comes up. Right. So right. I mean, probably because we smell bad. <laughs> Like, luckily, there's only three of us on this tour. Like, in, in previous tours where we've toured with other bands, it's like, it's like oh, we got to find a house or, like, a place for seven dudes to stay right now. Like, where's that going to happen, you know? What about that uh, other band? Are they any good? What's their name? Uh, we toured around with a couple bands recently. Uh, we toured around the... Well, we toured around last year with a band called The Happy Death, and they're uh, they're pretty decent. Um, we've known those guys for a bit. Uh, yeah, 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 they're they're right. they're, good, they're good kids. They'll they'll get it they're one of these kids. days. Um, but then uh, we toured recently with a band called Noble Furs, uh, mostly for political reasons. All right, I wanted to ask you guys a little bit about the songwriting process. Okay. Now, who writes the lyrics? Generally, Dan. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm the uh, I'm the lyricist. Okay. All the all the wordy bits. Uh -huh. the, I I tackle that. I have a I have a dream diary that I keep. Nice. And uh, I'm very sensitive. Right. Um, and uh, a book, a small book of poems. Okay. So just mostly just that. Mm-hmm. For sure. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Fuck that's, yeah. That's that's a song, song that's actually a uh, lyrically I wrote about. Uh, when we toured with this band, Happy Death, and uh, like I, I, I kind of mentioned before, they were all into like Satan worship, and right. uh, you know a lot of a lot of strange, uh, strange dark presence kind of hovered around the band. But then we're kind of like the song is kind of written from our perspective. It's like, well, we're not we're not really tapping into that force. We we walk our own you know path of truth and have kind of this this very pure oil that's that's running the rig. And so the song is kind of more like those two forces interacting and, and kind of what happens.
Uh, now, I know that you've written songs that sound like they're about females, but not necessarily one was like about your house or like where you grew up. Um, that they sound like it's a love song, but it's actually about something else. Well, I like I like that idea a lot about <laughs> you know. Um, yeah, I mean, just writing based on, on feelings or something, mm -hmm. you know, maybe not about a specific person, but right. more about a relationship, and maybe that doesn't necessarily have to be about a person, but right. it, could, it could be about a thing. Right. Um, what about brown liquor? Is that about a person, or is it about a house? You know, it's kind of, it's it's about it's about a person. I think I think that song is more about two people, but neither of those people might be me, you know? Fair enough. you guys in May of 2013 and I have a toy bus. Do you have any good memories with that toy bus? Any specific good memories? I remember um, when we left <coughs> for this last tour we went mm -hmm. on, um, our then tour manager went and bought a bottle of champagne and uh, we christened our new van before the tour with it and it took like Four or five different times to like smash it on the thing, yeah. and third try. third try. That bus was just like mocking us. <laughs> it was just like staring at us, like you guys need to do this right. Pretty much, pretty much. It was cool. Yeah. Can I ask you a question really fast? Yeah. Please. Is that a boy or a girl bus? No one knows. Okay. No one knows. It's, right. it's shrouded in mystery. That's fine. Androgynous. It is androgynous. I mean, it's kind of an asshole, but it's a good bus overall. Because it was yeah. mocking you after all. <laughs> but you guys are in close quarters. Everyone needs their space. What is the most creative place or most fucked up place you wanked it? This poor old woman's house. Like, we stayed in this... So what is it? This nice... <laughs> 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 this poor old woman. <laughs> Wait, it wasn't her. It was her um, house, right? No, we went, okay. we went to this... We, we played this show... I'm sorry. ...in... Uh, Somewhere by Mount Shasta, and we uh, we stayed at this really really nice drunk woman's house. We were probably <laughs> like whole story fifty or something. No, listen, this <laughs> is really <laughs> nice drunk. Let me set the scene no, here real we, uh, quick. We stayed there, and we left our guitars in Shasta City, and mm -hmm. then we drove all the way to Chico and forgot. Oh, <laughs> so we had to drive all the way back to Shasta, mm -hmm. and when we got there, the first thing I did was just. Oh, you didn't. You didn't even do it while we were staying there. No, uh, I did so it when we ran in to get the guitars. Did you go in the bathroom? Uh, huh? In the bathroom? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm not, I'm not an I think the. <laughs> 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 not an animal. No, on our front lawn. <laughs> like everyone saw it. I looked the dog right in the eye. Cause it threw up on me that I didn't. <laughs> Thank you. 
watching. We're at Simon Space. I'm Namis. I think they're pretty cool. And this bus is awesome. It's called the Super Groovy Cosmic Bus, and it'll take you on a magical journey, probably to one of their shows. Uh, so Check it out. Yep, stay tuned. Thank you, Simon Space. Thank you, Nick Gatman. Simon Space. Thank you, Anonymous. Thank you. We'll be back. We're oh. just we're just doing this for all the money. For all the money, right? We're, uh, we're rolling in the pennies. Reebok still a company? Yeah. Oh, really? They only make old white people shoes though, don't they? Reebok? They only make the big ass white shoes now. I would wear Reeboks if they saw this and they were like, we're gonna set you Reeboks. Right? Like, we're nothing but. Yeah, for Red Bull, if you guys are watching, we want all Red the free Red Bull that you can give Red us. We'll, we'll happily, uh, yes. we'll, we'll rep your products, we'll wear sweatbands and, and t-shirts. Yeah. And... We just don't want to pay for it anymore. We're a blank canvas. We're, we're, we're open book. Red Bull, you way. may shape us in your image. Exactly. We don't care as long as you say anything. We'll do anything for money. We'll sell out. Anything. All of our ideals for money. Yes. Yes. Would you endorse condoms? Anything. I'm sorry. I don't know. Let's just not do that. Would we endorse condoms? I don't know. Like, like our name just, on the condom? What about toothpaste? Anything. Toothpaste? Anything? Right. You would just sell out your art and soul. Yeah. I'm that not too like... cool to get big off of a toothpaste. <laughs> I'm just not too cool to. I don't know, that's dude. I'm, all right, that's I'm all done here. I'm really and now, economics are all about chasing. That's that all paper. you get. Chasing that paper. Yeah. Chasing that paper. That paper. So if anybody's listening with paper, we only care about money. Yep. We would prefer money over any kind of uh, respect. We would actually prefer money yeah. over anything. We don't care who our fans are. We're all Republicans. George W. Bush. Counter counterculture. Anthrax. We will play at churches. Uh, you guys are well. You have played at a church. We have for money. Play at for they money. Paid us for money.